Among the funerary items found with Tutankhamun was a lotus-shaped goblet made of alabaster. Inscribed around the rim are the following lines. May your ka live on. May you live for a million years. You who love and live in Thebes. May you face the north wind and your eyes look upon a beautiful place. I want you to know that the belief of the afterlife for the ancient Egyptian built Egypt. Because of that belief, the Egyptians built tombs, pyramids, temples, because they will live forever. And this is why death for the ancient Egyptian is not the end. It is the beginning of life. The people of both San Sheng Dwe and ancient Egypt sought to transcend the boundaries of life by seeking a pathway for their souls to heaven. We are curious. Did this path lead to the past or to the future? Generation upon generation, they attempted to defy the erosion of time with constant progress. They made persistent efforts to ensure that their culture never died. The ancient Shu people transformed the power of their imagination into exquisite works of art, some of which have survived as fragments. Over three millennia later, archaeologists and restorers have pieced together the forgotten memory of this ancient civilization. The Sun Xing Dwe Artifacts Restoration Laboratory is the first open conservation and restoration center in China. Here, the actual process of restoring artifacts is showcased for the public to see. People are able to witness at first hand the restoration of artifacts and to understand the technical skills involved. 